Right, little Miss Tiny has got her brace off. And little Miss Tiny's been bugger looks. Yes, you been bugger. Are you? She said, look at me. She said, look at me. She said, look, I'm so cool. Look at me walking. <laughs> She's still lifting her, le her little legs a little high. Um... Because she's had a brace on for so long. What the day? <laughs> Come on. Just ignore that at the bottom of the bed. <laughs> it's got to get folded and put away. But look how well she's doing. Look at this. Oh, I'm so proud of her. She's doing so well. Obviously, we do have the bandage. Hey! Yes, well done. No, I'm not going off there. Don't pick up my ring. Bugger looks. Oh, look at her. Look at her go. Well, he. Could we still be a he? We still don't know yet. One day, it'll either crow or lay an egg. <laughs> That's pretty much the best way to... Uh, we're not entirely too sure. I mean, could be one of either. Got very thick legs compared to her sister. Her sister's 73 grams. She's 69. So she's caught up. Look at these little feathers. Look at them little down. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Come here, baby girl. She's like, no. I'm free. I'm free. Where are you going? No, not off the puppy pad. No, <laughs> this is the puppy pad. Can't go over that way either. No. Come on. Yeah, freedom. It's gone to her head a little bit, but she's stretching when she stretches out. She stretches this leg. I mean, it, no. Come on. Come on. Back this way, please. Thank you. You know, when she stretches the poorly leg out, when it comes back, it goes right back into place, thankfully. <laughs> She's still lifting her little legs, but they're very thick little legs. Aren't they? Oh, you're such a puppies again. You need your bottom cleaned again, you dirty mare. Oh, dirty mare? No, not off the edge. You stay on the puppy pad, madam. Yes. When she's on me, I'll make sure I've got an old towel on me because she a puppies. Yes, little Miss Poop Machine. Yes, a wee little Miss Poop Machine. She says, look at me, I'm so pretty. But yeah, so it came off this morning. <laughs> Still got to get the balance a bit right, the Got to, got to get the balance right. So when she picks one leg up to have a have a scratch, she does tend to fall over. Come back here. Come on, here's a good girl. Look at that. How well is she doing? But yeah, when she stretches out, oh, we're gonna have a sit. We're gonna sit. Yes, little Miss Pretty. She says, "Oh, look at my pretty wings." Still a little bit behind, but she's catching up very quickly. So look at that! Look at that on the look at that! How cute is that? The tiniest tail you have ever seen. <laughs> she says, "But yes, look at these. These are proper. What? These are proper feathers now." She says they're not just all fluff, you know. She says, "Look, I'll show you." And you got some fluff stuck. <laughs> she's got some fluff stuck to her beak. <laughs> Oh, but I'm so proud of her. She's just done so well. I mean, well, he, she has got... She's got a really strong personality. You know, very stubborn little bugger. Aren't ya? Yeah, you are. Yeah, very sassy and very stubborn. Knows what it wants and it's going to get it. Because she's very spoiled. So, she'll be out now... I'll put her back to get something to eat and drink and then she'll scream the house down to come back out. Because obviously I am mum. So, yes, we snuggle with mummy, don't we? But hopefully we're on day 13 of our eggs today. So hopefully on the 27th of June is day 21. That's when they're due to pip and hatch, hopefully. Fingers crossed, everything will go okay. And little miss here will have four new friends. Or oh, little mister. Still not 100% sure. But like I said, one day 
it's either going to drop an egg or it's going to crow. So, thankfully, we've got amazing neighbours. They are wonderful. Um, and they've all said, doesn't matter. You know, I mean, shoot, if it does turn out to be a boy, I'll have, definitely have to have a night box, won't you? Mm. Yes, yeah, so you don't wake the neighbours up at 4 a, 3, 4 a.m. when as soon as uh, dawn turns up. As soon as it starts getting light, normally they crow. So it'll have a night box if it is a boy, which will keep all of the light out completely. Um, it'll have a good ventilation system, obviously. Um, Richard will make that for her, him, even, whatever it is. Um, still going with her, but Tiny is a name that can that fits for a boy or a girl, so it doesn't really matter. But look, I'm just so proud. I really am. Come on, over here. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Who's clever? Oh, look at that. Oh, we didn't fall over that time. Well done. He's clever. Oh, mommy's got sparklies. Oh, what's that? Oh, is that different? Yeah. No, we're not going off the bed, little Miss Pooper. Little Miss Poopy Machine. No, oh, okay, we're going to just sit. Yeah. Is that right? There you go, settling down to go to sleep now. Honestly, she'd just sleep quite happily here, wouldn't you? Hmm. Oh, look at that. We get in there. Well done. Now, come on this side. Come on, there we go. Come on. Come on. Come on, Tiny Terra. Tiny Terra. It's like, no. No, you don't. Little Mr. Escapee or Little Miss Escapee. Whatever may be the case. Oh, we've got a bit of an itchy ear going on. Couldn't do that before. And she quite likes stretching at the moment as well. She now realised she can move. Up, 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 don't do that. Now realised she can move and then starts flapping her wings and running at the same time. <laughs> don't be dead. Did you a twip? Oh dear me. Did you a twip? As you can see. The development's coming on lovely now. Now her body's had time to heal. Everything's gone into... All the energy that her body's had, I think, has gone into... Um, healing her body. And now... Now her body's healed. Starting to develop properly now. I don't think it'll be long before it's fully developed. Really. As I said, her sister is 73 grams as of today. She's 69. So, I mean, four grams dis uh, difference compared to how poorly she was when we had uh, when you were hatched, weren't you? Yes. Because your spine was all bent as well, wasn't it, sweetie? But now it's lovely and straight. So, yeah, so proud. So proud. I do apologise for the dirty butt. She's going to have to have it scrubbed again. She insists on sitting in the same place all the time. There's only so many times a day you can poop pick. Ain't that? Yeah. Little Miss Dirty Mare. Are we going to go see peas now? Are we going to go see peas now? Are we? Oh, tired girl. Tired girl. She's like, no, I'm not tired. I'm not going to sleep. Nope, not going to happen. <laughs> but yeah, I just thought I'd give everybody an update. I'm so chuffed with how she's doing. She stands up lovely and straight now. Touch wood so far. Every time she stretches her leg, goes back to where it should be. It's always going to have a little bit of a twist to it. But it doesn't hurt. So as long as she's pain free, that's all that matters. And healthy, obviously. Isn't it, baby? Yes. You're a pretty baby. Oh, you're a pretty baby. Yeah, you're a pretty baby. Hmm? You're a gorgeous girl. Hmm? Right. Bye-bye, guys.